Hey everybody, Captain Mike here. Welcome to my flight deck. For those of you that have been following along know that I've been taking a, a look at DIM, Device Interface Manager, that's going to allow my flight deck to uh, interact with MS-2020 through PMDG. And the last video I put up showed that I had the two CDUs and the MCP connected to uh, PMDG through MS-2020. However, none of the buttons, dials, and switches, and whatnot were working on the PMDG aircraft. And as it turns out, it was a setting in MS-2020, depending on whether you have uh, an Xbox controller or you're using a mouse. So it was set on lock, and it should have been on legacy for my mouse. So that's been corrected, and it now has given me an opportunity to take a closer look at the uh, CDUs. I'm sorry about the camera angle, but in order for me to get you a good view, I'd have to rewire a bunch of stuff and install software, so I wasn't about to do that. Ooh, a little winded here. But um, as you can see on the top of the screen, that's PMDG, and you're looking at their two CDUs inside MS-2020, and down here we have my hardware running the DIM uh, software. And I'm going to run through the buttons on both of these just to confirm that they are, in fact, working. Um, I know I don't have any uh, lights just yet. Uh, trying to figure that one out. Um, hopefully that will get worked out in the not-too-distant future. But the main thing right now are the buttons. So if I press on the FMC button on the captain, you'll see it matches that of the PMDG. Do the same thing on the first officer's side. Oh, what did I push here? FMC. It should be giving me the index. There we go. And I have to check that and make sure that's right. All right, so let's go. We'll start right from the top. Ident. Ident. And we'll go back to index. Index. Position. Position. Back to index. Preferences or performance. And that looks good. Index. Take off. Take off. And they look good. And let's go back to index. Approach. That looks good. And nav data. Nav data. Back to index. Alternate test. Okay. Index. Configuration, return, and menu, that's all looking pretty good, back to FMC, maintenance, maintenance, so this is all looking pretty good, simulation, simulation, return, return, so this is all looking real nice now. So, menu, oops, menu, menu. Let's check the keypad here. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, point zero. And that looks good. Let's put a plus or minus and a plus in there. There's a plus. And there's the minus. Very good. Let's clear that. So that works. Let's put delete up there. Clear that. Okay. And we have A, B. I'm just going to run through this real quick.
and that takes us to X. Oh. Oh, I guess that don't clear it out. Usually you hit the delete, clear, and you get the clear screen. Or at least that's what I was used to anyway. All right, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay, let's clear that out. All these buttons are looking pretty good. FMC, ident. I'll go through some of these. Route. That looks pretty good. And let's check this side. Looks good. There's your zero and your plus. Let's clear that out. And that takes us to T. That all looks pretty good. XYZ, that looks pretty good to me. So I would say that this is looking pretty decent. I haven't noticed any issues um, at all, other than, like I said, the, uh, the lighting. So, another step closer to getting the two of these working together. And this is without the bridge. This is just dim with the uh, 2020 and the PMDG aircraft. So I don't think I'm going to get the... Uh, the bridge working any smoother with those flickers so I believe this is going to be the way to go anyway I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick little update and uh, I'll catch you on my next run everybody take care